over to East Molesey in Surrey to meet the only dogs we ever heard of which cannot bark. They're Basenjis, a breed of dog which nearly became extinct until Miss Veronica Tudor Williams revived the strain with puppies found in the Belgian Congo. That was 25 years ago. Today, Veronica sends Basenjis all over the world. 26 of the dogs from her kennels have been champions. One, with which she will not part, was once asked for by an American who offered a thousand pounds. Basenjis make fine pets, friendly, handsome and clean, but they make bad house dogs because they can't bark. The only noise they can make, and then only when very excited, is a high-pitched yodel. One of the oldest breeds surviving today, drawings of the Basenjis were found on ancient Egyptian tombs. By the time the tombs were found, the dogs had become unknown. Eight years ago, King Farouk sent a special envoy to Britain to buy one of the dogs. It's a dog's life not being able to hold a real pup-to-pup -pup talk, but mother's always around to grumble to, and anyway, who wants to bark when there's biting work to do? Cats lick for the end of a dog's dinner, and the only crack we daren't make around here is the one about a dog's bark being worse than his bite. <laughs>